explosions are the best part to helping EOD out. That's Las Vegas native and 110 Cav Quick Reaction Force medic, Private First Class James Buco. He explains what they are doing this morning with the 749th Explosive Ordnance Disposal Company. Well, we came here, picked up some fertilizer, loaded it up. We're going to do a controlled detonation, but it's good that we're picking it up. So it's off the streets, so it doesn't help out with the HME labs that are going around here. It's not hurting the AUP, ANP, and other Afghan uh, national forces that we got, and also the locals. HME, or homemade explosive, is the primary material used by insurgents in Afghanistan for roadside bombs. The two units from Fort Carson, Colorado, are loading an estimated 2,000 pounds of ammonium nitrate collected by the Afghan National Police on various occasions. In 1995, 4,000 pounds of ammonium nitrate was used in the Oklahoma City bombing. Specialist Jacob Gaultier of 749th EOD explains how the Afghan government ban on ammonium nitrate is affecting insurgent operations. They have to make their own HME now instead of just buying this at a farming store or somewhere where you get you know, fertilizer and just grounding it down. That's, I mean, that's how easy it was. Now they're having to switch to making their own. So it's really helping out. Once the truck was loaded, the convoy moved to a safe area, away from civilians for the controlled explosion. EOD team leader from Washington, North Carolina, Sergeant First Class Charles Deans, explained what will happen next. Soldiers from 749th EOD basically uh, getting rid of ammonium nitrate. Um, and because we can't carry enough explosive to get rid of the amount that we have today, we're actually trying to blow it into the air to spread it out because it's a fertilizer. Um, and we picked this spot in between the mountains so that the, the mountains can channel the blast wave up and away from, from any homes or uh, fobs in the area. Sergeant Deans continues to explain the benefits of destroying the fertilizer. Here in the next year or so after the rainy season, this will probably be uh, one of the greenest areas in Afghanistan for, for a couple of months. Um, so yeah, it's pretty good for the environment, it doesn't hurt anything. After placing the explosive charges with the fertilizer, the soldiers moved to a safe distance to view their work. Hey EOD, this is Red 4, you're clear to blow it when you're ready. Reporting for the 319th Roger Mobile that. Public Affairs Detachment outside of Kandahar City, Afghanistan. All stations is net. Fire in the hole, fire in the hole, fire in the hole. Go. I'm U.S. Army Staff Sergeant Walter Talents.